There was the odd sprinkle of rain over the city today and you might have even spotted some lightning and thunder. Let's go to the weather with Tiff Warne. Tiff, what's happening there at AFL Max? Kate, we're here at AFL Max where the kids from Yorktown Area School have travelled three hours for an amazing school sleepover camp. So as you can see, the kids behind me have got the mattresses out there watching, I think, cars. They're going to get popcorn and a donut after what's been a very fun-filled day of activities, bonding. They've been working on leadership skills, so plenty of fun. Time for one last look at the weather in the city. We had an overnight low of 18 degrees, reaching this top of 25. Not too much rain around, just 0.4 mils in the West Terrace gauge and that bid of thunder and lightning. On the satellite, a complex low pressure system in the bite extends over southeastern Australia, generating broad areas of cloud with embedded thunderstorms. On the synoptic, we can see that broad trough of low pressure connecting to a low pressure system over the bite, which has been causing this miserable weather that will gradually weaken before clearing to the east tomorrow. Around the country tomorrow, Melbourne 33 with showers and a possible storm. Perth 28 and sunny, 29 for Hobart with showers, a partly cloudy 29 for Sydney. Returning home to SA, Maitland and Clare heading for 24, some showers around Port Augusta and Wyala 27, 31 for Roxby Downs and Cooper Pedy, 23 and partly cloudy in Sejuna. Further south, 33 in Renmark, New York, per 25. Victor Harbour, 24 in Mount Gambier, Narracourt and Keith, 28 with a shower or two. Kingscote and Port Lincoln heading for 23 degrees. Around the suburbs tomorrow, 25 for Elizabeth and Glenelg with a shower or two. 24 for Norlunga, 27 the top in Murray Bridge. In Adelaide, we'll have an overnight low of 17, reaching a top of 25 with a medium chance of showers. Looking ahead at the rest of the week, 22 on Thursday. Cloudy skies expected. Friday's 21 with a chance of a shower. Saturday Today is still relatively cool, cool, 22 and partly cloudy, but then it finally starts to look like summer by Sunday. 29 and sunshine Monday should make 33, Tuesday a cooler top of 23. Now, Kate, AFL Max is open for the school holidays. It's just around the corner, so plenty of fun for the kids. And a good spot for a wet day. Thank you, Tiff. That's Adelaide's 10 News First for now. Thanks for your company. I'll have updates throughout the evening, but for now, stay with us for the project. Good night.